mental health is important for both genders. It's not about men versus women or placing a priority on one over the other. Women face really unique societal and biological challenges in their life and that can play a really significant role in impacting their mental health. We look at things like polycystic ovary syndrome, endometriosis, the whole perinatal period, menopause for just as examples. Lip Timber started as a fundraiser and has evolved into a national foundation that's the trusted source and the respected leader within women's mental health in Australia. A critical element in our foundation's work is our research and we conduct this now annually and we're incredibly proud of it because it's not being done anywhere else in this country and what this research does is it allows our foundation to identify the priority areas within women's mental health and the areas that we need to distribute funds towards. So we've seen through the research that the top five issues for women's mental health in Australia are depression, anxiety, body image, psychological distress and PTSD. One of the biggest takeaways from this year's report was further support required for that perinatal period being when a woman first becomes pregnant through to when the baby is around one year of age. So our research is telling us that 62% of pregnant women are facing a mental health issue and a staggering 35% of those are facing a severe disorder, which is really, really concerning. So we've funded projects in the past around supporting mothers and new mothers, such as MBO Australia, which was a groundbreaking program that supported the connection between mothers and infants. And as of recently, we've funded projects supporting the mental health of women who may have received unexpected news around the health and development of their unborn baby through to single session online treatments for new and expectant mothers to help tackle some of those barriers to seeking support around time, cost and accessibility. So we have key events throughout the year that help support the work the foundation does. And one of those key events is our flagship fundraiser, Lip Timber, that we run every September, where we encourage women to go out and purchase a Lip Timber lipstick from any chemist warehouse store and jump online register and commit to wearing that lipstick throughout the month. But if lipstick's not your thing, you can also get involved by making a general donation or even becoming a regular giver of the foundation. I get that a lot is that question around being a male, you know, focused on a women's mental health foundation. And I think it's really important for men to acknowledge and understand the important role unique biological factors can play in a woman's mental health and also for women to and men to support people in their lives that may be going through some of these physical challenges and understanding how that could be placing further burden on their own mental health.